Now, how will you pronounce it? Jalasatit Talibu. Jalasatit Talibu. Okay? This is how we connect two words because there is a beauty and eloquence in doing that. Jalasatit Talibu. Instead of saying Jalasat Atalibatu, we say Jalasatit Talibatu. So, you will have to be careful. Many times you will see Kasra in the Quran. Brother, and that kasra is there because you want to join it. Okay, but you, as a student of Arabic language, we, as a student of Arabic language, we will know what is actually there. Actually, it is tau tanisi with a sukun. Huh? We only put a kasra to join it. This is what number four is, brother. Number five, brothers and sisters. Number five is uh, again comes with Allah so we will stop here take a break recharge our batteries and then we will do this but brother this this will finish in next 15 20 minutes the way we are going maybe by midnight tonight we'll finish the book huh? <laughs> okay brother we will now take a break, inshallah. We are back, brothers and sisters, after delicious doklas. Jazakallahu khairan, ya Salma, for treating the class. And inshallah, uh, you will uh, bring some nice treats for the class every now and then, inshallah. <laughs> okay. So, now it is, we are only supposed to read, what is it? Ikra Jumlal Atiyata. Read the following sentence. But my request is that you should write also. You should write also. Huh? Okay, brother. First is a question. So we will only translate. Manil fatal ladhi kharaja min. Min has come. What should be afterwards? Baiti. Min baiti. Mashallah. Manil. Fatal ladhi kharaja min baitika al ana. Who is the young fellow? See, Muzakkar. Huh? Al fata is Muzakkar. So, al ladhi came huh? as a naat. Huh? Min al baitika al ana. What is the answer? Wabnu ammi. Huwa mubtada. Wabnu ammi. How many words? Three words. Huh? Three words. Don't forget Ya Mutakalam. If you forget it. <laughs> she is there. Ya Mutakalam. Are you with me? Wabnu, Ammi, and then Ya Mutakalam. Okay? So, Ibnu is your Khabar, Mudaf, Mudafilehi, Mudaf, Mudafilehi. Now, see, Fata, Al Fata, is Muzakkar. And what is Muannas? Al Fata tu. Huh? So when you say al-fatatu, al-lazi will change into al-lati. Got the idea? That's the, what Dr. Abdurrahim wants to learn. Did you get it, Sister Salma? Fatatu, Sister Naima, is followed by al-lati. Al-fata was followed by al-lazi. Why? Muzakkar and Mornas. So, manil fatatu lati kharajat. See, before it was kharaja. Now it became kharajat min baitika al-ana ya Muhammad hiya bintu khalati. So bintu khalati, how many words? Three words. Khabar, wa huwa mudaf, khalati mudaf ilahi, wa huwa mudaf, and ya mutakallim mudaf ilahi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Or shall I write it? Huh? I did? Okay. See, brother, hiya. Huh? Bin tu. Kha la ti. Are you with me, brother and sister? What is hiya? Muqtada. What is this, brother? Khabar. Plus mudaf. What is this? 
moda elehi. Are you with me? Plus mudav. And what is this? Mudav elehi. Does it make sense now? Sisari, huh? Hiya bintu khalati. She is the daughter of my khala. Are you with me? Bintu khala ti. Khalu, mother's brother. And what is khalati? Mother's sister. Number three. Liman, liman, miftahul ladhi alal maktabi. Who, liman, miftahu, to whom does this key, alazi, belong to, alazi, which is on the desk. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Liman miftahu al-lazi al-al-maktabi. To whom this key belongs to, which is on the maktab, desk. What is the answer? Huwa lil-mudarrisi. Huwa mubtada al-mudarrisi jar majur shibu jumla khabar. Lil-mudarrisi jar majur shibu jumla khabar. Very good. Next one, brother. Liman sa'atu al-lati. See, miftahu muzakkar. So, al-lazi came. And sa'atu muannas. So, what came? Do you see the difference? Sister Naima? Muannas, muzakkar. Do you see the difference? Sister Maimuna, do you see the difference, sister? Inshallah. Sister Arifa, you feel the difference? Sister Faiza, how about you, Sister Salma? Can you see the difference? Inshallah. Huh? Sister Manas, you can see the difference? Inshallah. Sister Nasri, Nusrat. Sister Fatima, Sister, do you see the difference? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. What is the answer? Here, Li Zawji Ukhti. Maybe I should do it again. Huh? Hiya li zawji. I'm putting ya mutakalam at the end. How many words li zawji ukhti? Four. How many? Four. Huh? What is the first? Li, harchar. Then, zawji. And then, ukhti. And then, ya mutakalam. Do you see? Four. So I will say, what do, you, do I say here? Mubtada. And what is this? Harchar. Okay? Harchar, isam majroor. Huh? Okay? And then, harchar, and what is this? Isim Majroor plus Mudaf. What is this? Mudaf Ilehi plus it is. I'm sorry, I'm overwriting things here. And in the end, what is in the end? Mudaf Ilehi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Is it clear? Inshallah. So where is our khabar? Li zawji. Li zawji. Jar majur shibu jumla khabar. Okay. Now, brother, we go back to number one. We go back to number one. Do you see Alladhi has been underlined? Okay, fine. And that is our ismu mausula. Tell me where is Salatul mausula for number one? Kharaja min baytika al-ana. Everything is Salatul Mausul. Number two. Where is, is 
Ismul Mausul Allati. Where is where is the Silatul Mausul? Again up to Al Ana. You won't say Ya part of Silatul Mausul because Ya is a Harfu Nida and Muhammad is a Munada. Okay? So only up to Al Ana. Okay? Number third, Al Lazi Alal Maktabi. Where is Silatul Mausul? Alal Maktabi. Are you with me, Sister Salma? Huh? Alal Maktabi. Now tell me, Sister Salma, number four, where is Silatul Mausul? Alas Sariri. Are you with me, everybody? Huh? Fine. Akmil Jumalal Atiata Bivadai. Now you will put suitable Isam Mausula, Allazi, or Allati in the blanks. Huh? In the blanks. Sister Salma, you take the first one. Al Kitabu. There is a blank. What will you put? Will you put Allati or Allazi? Allazi. Why? No, why? You, your answer is right, but I am asking you why. No, your, uh, the, your answer should be because Al Kitab is Muzakkar, so Ismul Mausula is Muzakkar. Are you with me? Huh? You will see. If a mausola, you will put according to what you are trying to explain. You know, in this case, Allazi is coming to explain about the al kitab. Are you with me? That is the reason. And where is Salatul Mausul? Al al Maktabi. So al kitab is Mubtada. And where is the khabar? Where is the khabar, Sister Arifa? Lil Mudaris. Mashallah. Okay. Number uh, Abir, you try to explain. Al Kalamu. Al Kalamu Al Lazi Fi Haki Dati Maksurun. Yes. See, Al Kalamu Maksurun. That is the sentence. Mubtada Khabar. So Al Lazi, because Al Kalamu is. Al Kalamu is Muzakka. So use Al Lazi. Sister Abir, tell me where is Salatul Masul? Fi Haki Dati. That's it. Fi hakibati. Maksurun is khabar. Got the idea? Okay. Very good. Sister Faiza. Asayaratu. What will you say? Lati. Mashallah. Allati. Because sayaratu is monas. Now it will come. Allati. Very good. Yes. So, Sayaratu is your Muftada. Where is Khabar? Let Tabibi Jadili. Jadid is not. Let Tabibi. Tell me where is the Silatul Mausul, Sister Faiza? Al Ana. Up to Al Ana. Are you following now, brothers, everybody? We are going in a little detail so that you get some idea. You know, Again, I repeat, even if you understand 70%, 75%, it is good. Because we will be repeating it all the time and you will get stronger, inshallah. Sister Fatima, Al Kalbu, what will you say after Al Kalbu? Al Lazi, mashallah. Al Kalbu, Al Lazi, then Fil Hadikati. Jar Majroor. What is the last thing? Maridun. What is the sentence actual? Al Kalbu Maridun. Dog is sick. Okay? Don't be surprised. Huh? Dog can also get sick. Huh? But poor fellow cannot say, I am sick. Huh? So, where is the Silatul Mausul, Sister Fatima? Silatul Mausul. Can you figure out? Fil hadikati. Where is it? Fil hadikati. That is your silatul masul. Would you agree with me? Sister Abir, is it correct? Inshallah. Okay. Now it is al-fatah. Sister Naima, al-fatah. The young fellow. What will you say? Al-lazi. Again, kharaja min al-masjidi al-ana. And what is next one? Ibn al-Muazzini, son of Muazzam. The young fellow 
who came out of the masjid now is the son of Muazzin. Huh? Okay? So where is your khabar? Ibn Wahua Mudaf and Al Muazzin Mudafili. Okay. Where is the Silatul Mawsul if you can figure out? Kharaja min al Masjidi Ana. Up to here is your Silatul Mawsul. MashaAllah. Now, sisters, G, uh, 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 you got your Muftada and Khabar, okay. Huh? Uh, Sister Sukhaina, number six is yours. <laughs> MashaAllah. Uh, okay, brother, look at it. Telka is your Muftada. And Sister Sukhaina, what is Battatu? Badal, mashallah. Tilkal battatu. So battatu is badal. Got it? Everybody got it? Badal. And then al, it is muanna, so you will say allati. Now that will come as a naat. Okay. Tahta shajarati. Yeah, tahta shajarati is silatul mausul. Tahta shajarati is your silatul mausul. What is tahta? Zarf. And what is Sajarati? Mudafilehi. These two are Silatul Mausul. Huh? And where is the Khabar for? But uh, Tilka, where is the Khabar? Li Bintil Fillahi. How many words are there? Three. Huh? Li Binti Jar Majrur. Huh? Shibu Jumla Khabar. Alhamdulillah, you got it. Huh? Sister. Sister Arifa. Al Baytul Jadidu. Lil Waziri. No, Sister Arifa, tell me where is Muftida. Al Baytu. And what is Al Jadidu? No. Remember, it is. No. Not Al Baitu Al Jadidu, the new house. Al Baitu Al Jadidu. Are you with me? Al Baitu Al Jadidu. Inshallah, we are going to devote a little extra time on uh, adjectives. Huh? I will, Inshallah, I will tell you to read the page in the handout, then we'll work here. Okay, brothers and sisters. Al Baitu Mubtada. Al Jadidu. Naat. Again, Allazi will be Naat here. Okay? Now, Fi Zalik Shari. What is this Fi Zalik Shari? Silatul Mausul. Fine. Silatul Mausul. Who said that? Silatul Mausul? Who, who said that? Okay, Sukhaina, that is correct. But inshallah, I'll ask you. I'm, I'm trying to ask Sister Arifa everything. Huh? I'm trying to ask Sister Arifa everything. Sister Arifa, fi zalik shari. Okay. Fi, what is fi? Everybody should watch this sentence. Fi, harfchar. What is zalika? Isam majru. Harfchar, isam majru. So brother and sister, zalika has come. What is the shari? Badal. What is it? What is badal? Are you with me, sister Arifa? Shari is badal because it comes after zalika. All of sisters, all of you, you got it? Here, I want you to understand fi, harjar, zalika, isam majroor, and shari is badal. Lil waziri, what is lil waziri, sister Arifa? Shibu jumla khabar. So, where is the sentence? Al-Baytul Jadidu Lil Waziri. Got the idea? That is your sentence. Al-Baytul Jadidu Lil Wazir. Fine. Now, Sister uh, Aisha, Adarsu. Masha Allah. Okay, now try to explain us. What is Adarsu? Muptida. And then you said Allazi, which is correct. What is Allazi? Naat. 
as a smum mausula, but it is also coming as a nath, because it is describing the dars. Okay? Fine. What is baada? Zarf. And what is haza? After, after zarf comes mudafili. Huh? Okay? So it is mudafili. And watch carefully. Haza darsi. What is darsi? Badal. Mashallah. Did everybody get it? She said, Naiva, Haza came. And what is after Haza? Dars came with Alif Lam, definite. And if Haza, Bada is Zarf. Zarf will have Mudafilahi, which is Majroor. So is Haza Majroor? Is Haza Majroor? Raise your hands who you know it. Is Haza Majroor? Yes, it is Majroor. Why it is Majroor? Because it came after the after the zarf. So you see, haza we cannot see anything because it has got only one uniform. Huh? It's only one form, haza haza. But now I know haza is majroor because it has come after a zarf. So it is mudafilihi. Now if the haza is majroor, the badal will also be majroor. Huh? Are you with me? That is why. Huh? Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Okay, brother. <clears throat> Sahlun. What is Sahlun? Khabar. And what is Jiddan? Jiddan means very. We are not going to go into that. But tell me, look at Jiddan, sister Aisha. Tell me what do you see there? Jiddan. Ji? It is Mansub, mashallah. May Allah bless you and all of us. Zadikillahu huh? ilman, may Allah increase you in knowledge. So Jiddan, at least we know it is Mansub. Huh? Sister Salma, Brother Hassan, it is Mansub. Huh? Brother Farooq, why? We will learn later on in book 3. Okay, fine. So in other words, brothers and sisters, Baada uh, Hazad Darsi, what will you call Aisha Baada Hazad Darsi? Silatul Mausul. Are you getting there? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Next one, Sister uh, Yeah, okay. Now this this of course you will only Sister Mamuna. You will you will Allati will come Allati will come and Jalasat Amamal Madrasati will be the Silatul Mausul because it is a question I am not. Okay. Try to translate. Manil Fatatul Lati. In, no. Yeah, who's in the front of the teacher? Who is this young uh, sister who's sitting in front of the teacher? Sister Naima, you said you have a question? No, I You understood? Okay, fine. Now, what is the answer? In uh, Malaysia, she is a student. Uh, so, uh, here and Muqtada Talibatun is your khabar. Sister Nasir, would you like to attempt it? Now, again, it's a question mark. Okay. Li Sadiqi. Masha'Allah. Okay. So Allati came. Huh? How will you translate? That handbag which is under the desk belongs to you, Ya Khalid? Does it belong to you, Ya Khalid? What is the answer? No, here to my friend Muhammad. Father, everybody be careful. I'm writing it and we are going to analyze it. I will let Sister Nasreen do the job and then if she can't, then the next person will do the job. If she can't, 
then the next person will do the job. La, and what is it? Here, Li. See, I'm deliberately putting Ya little further, and then I'm writing Muhammadin. Okay, brother. La is a harfu nafi. Sahi? So, sir, Nasrin, what is here? Mubtada, mashallah. And what is Lee? Harfcha. Harfcha should have a ism majroor. Where is ism majroor? Sadiqi. Wa huwa mudaf. And then ya mutakalim, mudaf ilahi. Sahi? Are you with me? Okay, let me write it down. Lee. Harfcha. Sadiqi. Ism majroor. Plus. Mudaf and Ya Mutakallim Mudaf Ilahi. Got the idea? Three words. Sister Nasri, what is this Muhammadin doing here? Who is he? Now, Khabar is your Li Sadiqi. And remember, if the Khabar is one word, it is always Marfu. It is not that. Okay, Sister Mainas. It is badal, mashallah, mashallah. How did you figure out? Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. May zadik Allahu ilman. May Allah increase your knowledge. Now look at this. This is the another way of badal coming. Now you got to watch. See, if I say only li sadiki, is it complete? Sentence is complete. Yes, it belongs to my friend. Now I remove sadiki. And I say, he Ali, Muhammadin. It's still the complete sense. So Muhammadin is somewhere related into here. Where is it related, brother? Muhammad? Sadiqi. Sadiq. So if Sadiqi comes, then Muhammadin is the badal for, substitute for Sadiqi. I can change it. Are you with me? I can change it. I can just say, he Ali, Muhammadin. Even if I remove it, I say he ali sadiqi. But if I use both of them, he ali sadiqi, and then Muhammadin is the substitute for sadiqi. Sadiqi is a sum majroor. Sahi? Are you with me? So the badal has to be majroor. Got the idea? Why it is Muhammadin? Because mubdal minhu. Do not worry about that term. From where the badal is coming. So, where is the badal coming from? Sadiqi. Li harfchar. Sahi? Is li harfchar? And what is sadiqi, Sister Abir? Isam majroor. Yeah. What is li harfchar? Isam majroor. Okay? Now, what is Muhammad? Is, is the substitute for sadiqi. So if this is majroor, then the badal has to be majroor. Huh? Write it down this, brothers and sisters. This is uh, one of the uh, different form of badal we will be getting, coming ac- across them. In the Quran they will come and you will be able to figure out. But then my point is this, I am going in detail. I am not supposed to. But I think you are very strong and if we study slowly, slowly, you will, you will, inshallah, you will, inshallah, Learn. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters? And you will understand. Did you understand this? How the Muhammad became Badal? Inshallah. Huh? Again at home, you will read it and think over it. Fine, brother. Al Kalimatul Jadidatu. Al Ammu. What is Al Ammu? What is Al Ammu? Al Akhul Akhul Abi. Brother of Fah. Father. Huh? So, brother, Akhul Abi, what is Akhul Abi? Mudaf. Mudaf ilihi. Got it? Fine. Al Ammatu. Huh? Okay. Ukhtul Abi. What is Sister Salma? Ukhtul Abi? Ukhtul Abi is Sister Abi. Yeah, I know that. Oh, Muftada. No, Muftada, there is no Muftada Khabar. Mudaf, Mudaf ilihi. 
sister you said sister of so that is mudaf mudaf ilahi okay al khalu sister abil what is al khalu akhul ummi akhul ummi what is akhul ummi translate mother see you said brother of mother huh? very good now sister naima al khalatu al khalatu no ukhtul ummi huh? now ukhtul ummi is your mudaf mudaf ilayhi ukhtul ummi sister of the mother huh? al khalatu and then brother sayyidi masculine and sayyidati family mustashfal viladati maternity home hmm? alhamdulillah is it clear inshallah this lesson was not difficult it took us long little longer because i tried to go in detail and explain you salatul mausul i thought if i put that thing in your mind now you will be able to understand better later on how is it brother mohammed you have any question no, you is clear now brother We, this is a long lesson and it is very interesting lesson and, and watch for it brother brother here we come haza and what is here brother zalika and then hazihi and then tilka ha huh? Well, haza is your ismu ishara lil kareem muzakkar muannas zalika is your ismu ishara lil ba'id ha huh? muannas now we go to the plurals what is it what do we call it haulai jama for near what will be for the far it comes in the quran haulai and ulaika are you with me brothers and sisters are you looking at me ha ulai ismu ishara lil qareeb what is it brother and sister ismu ishara lil qareeb ha huh? ismu ishara lil qareeb ulaika ismu ishara lil ba'id are you with me if you will read the key which dr sahab has provided you will understand everything so inshallah you try to read ahead in the key at least little bit advance so that when i explain you you will understand better brother here it is masculine and feminine and here it is masculine and feminine what about haulai it is for both ha huh? this is for masculine plus feminine and this also brother and sister is for masculine plus feminine okay now we are not going to do the lesson now we are going to learn a little bit extra from lesson number 13 we are going to learn plurals ha huh? we are going to learn plurals and i want you to look on page number 69 in the old book Huh? on your left hand side what do you see plurals what are what do you see on the left hand side salma huh? look at there huh? what do you see on left hand side plurals do you see plurals okay i want you to make groups with your pencil huh? you will make a group like this huh? okay what is the first group look at the first word Brother Muhammad, what is the first word? Aza. No, uh, uh, we are only looking at the plurals. Uh, Tullabun. What is it? Tullabun. What is the 
singular of tulabun? Talibun. Sahih? So tulabun. Look at the word properly. Tulabun. But that the beauty of Arabic is amazing. Things come on certain patterns. And we will learn those patterns slowly, slowly. As they come in front of us, our mind will be able to identify them. Okay? Tullabun. What is the next one, Brother Muhammad? Tujjarun. Can you see a similarity? Tullabun. Tujjarun. Huh? Same pattern. Next one, brother? Hujjajun. See, you have to say it properly. Hujjajun. Huh? This three, you make a bracket. And the wazan is? You'll write down this wazan. Fu'alun. Huh? It is on the pattern of? Fu'alun. Huh? Now, we keep this pattern in mind, huh, brother and sister. You do not have to sit and memorize them. Just try to understand. Huh? There is a pattern. What is that pattern? Fu a lun. Yek pattern hai. Whenever you see some plurals, you will recognize that this is on the pattern of Fu a lun. Brother Hassan, what is your next one? Rajalun. What is singular? Rajulun. So Rajulun became Rajalun. And brother, next one? Uh, Kibarun. Kibarun. Are you with me? Kibarun. Okay. What is next one? Do you see it as a pattern? Sigarun. What is the next one? Kisarun. Huh? And what is the next one? Okay. See here? Kabirun became Kibarun. Sagirun became Sigarun. Kasirun became Kisarun. And Tawilun became Tiwal. These are the patterns. What is it in English, brother and sister? You just give S. You just give S and it becomes plural. But in Arabic, the plurals are like an ocean. They are different. But that is what makes it so beautiful and eloquent and colorful. And there is a sweetness and music into it in every word. Huh? Starting from Rijalun to Tewalun, put a bracket and what will you write down? Fialun. What is the pattern, brother? Huh? You will write it, huh? sister. On your book. Huh? Huh? Write down Fialun. See now, you see, fi, a, lun. Now look at, ri, ja, lun. Ki, ba, run. Si, ka, run. Are you see, can you see the pattern? Why, why I'm doing this, brother and sister? Just so that you have something there for you. Every now and then, this thing will click. Huh? And later on, after some time, when you will see a different nouns, Oh, you will say, okay, now this is plural on this pattern. Uh, and you will, inshallah, understand it, memorize it, inshallah. It will make it easy for you. Okay, brother uh, Abdul Samad, we have awladun, abnaun, amamun. Uh, okay, this is one pattern. Uh, put a bracket. What is singular of awladun? Waladun. And what is singular of Ibn. Ibnun? And what is the singular of Amamun? Ammun, your uncle, Chacha. Okay? Put a bracket. And what kind of a pattern we get? Af'alun. What is it? Af'alun. See, these are, these, these are made on this pattern. Af'alun. Brothers? You do not have to memorize it. Huh? Just write it for today. Huh? I want you to write it today and, and read it at home, all these jama. Huh? Okay. Shaykh Shuyukh. Daif Duyuf. What is the pattern now? Pu'ulun. 
What is the pattern? Fu'ulun. Brother, again today I will ask you to give me five minutes more. Huh? So, Sister Salma, are you with me? Fu'ulun. Shaykh. No, you know all shuyukh. You have heard this, but this is jama on a certain pattern. Huh? Fine. Next one is, brother, vumala'u and fukara'u. Huh? What is the pattern? You can even, inshallah, figure out. Fu'ala'u. Fu'ala'u. Keep on putting brackets. Huh? Fu'ala'u. What is the next one? Agniya'u. Asdika'u. Attiba'u. What is the pattern? Af'ila'u. Just write down. Today you are only writing af i la u. This later on will help you in understanding and memorizing, inshallah. Okay, brother. Fityatun, ikhwatun. This is two pattern. Huh? This two belongs to one pattern. Fialatun. What is it, brother and sisters? Fi'a, fi'alatun. I will only take five minutes more, no more than that. Fi'alatun. And then we have one more pattern. Jududun. The only one thing came. But the jadid. What is the plural of jadid? Judud. Huh? Judud. Okay. It is fu'ulun. What is it? Fu'ulun. Fu, u, lun. Fu, u, lun. Fu'ulun. Fu'ulun. Okay, brother, now comes a different pattern. What are they, brother? Now, mudarisuna, muhandisuna, fallahuna, mujtahiduna. Muslimuna, and I give you extra. Mu'minuna, Saimuna, Kanituna. Huh? Are you with me? No, what are these? These are patterns. So, what do you do? This pattern, only this pattern, starting from Mudari Suna until Muslimuna, it is called Jama Muzakkar Salim. Huh? What is it called? What do you say in English? Sound masculine plural. We are going to study this tomorrow again. Huh? But I thought if I introduce you now, you will be able to have some idea today. How do you make Jama Muzakkar Salim? Huh, brother? Uh, why is it called Jama Mudakkar Salim? Why it is called sound masculine plural? This is how you make it. Are you looking at me? Watch me, brothers and sisters. Sister Arifa. You add Wow Noon. Okay? To a singular. Okay? What is the singular here? Musli Mun. Okay? Now you add wow noon to it. What will it become? Muslim moon. Are you with me? When you made this, brothers and sisters, you did not break this. Did you break it? No. Still, Muslim moon is there in the plural. You did not break it. So, if you don't break it, it means it is sound muscular plural. Jama Muzakkar Salim. So, whenever the plurals are made on this pattern by adding wow noon, you call it sound masculine plural. Are you with me? Okay, we are only learning muzakkar now, brother. If I say mommy noon, make it plural, mommy noon. If I say saimun, saimun. If I say khashiun, khashiun. If I say hafizun, if I say Talibun, 
No, that is wrong. It is Tullabun. <laughs> you see, now we have to watch it. I said Talibun, you said Talibun, no, it is Tullabun. Are you with me? But if I tell you, brothers and sisters, uh, uh, Saimun, Saimun. If I say Hafizun, Hafizun. If I say Zakirun, Zakirun. Are you with me? Zakirun, Zakirun. Are you with me? So this is the pattern how you make from singular into plural. If you do it on this pattern, what is it called? Al Jama Muzakkar Salim. Huh? It is called Jama Muzakkar Salim. Sound, masculine, plural. Okay? One more minute, brother. Okay. Mudari Sun became Mudari Suna. Mohandi Sun became Mohandi Suna. Fallahun became Fallahuna. And Mujtahidun became Mujtahiduna. And Muslimun became Muslimuna. Okay, brother? And then if I say Mominun, Mominuna. Zakirun, Zakirun. Okay? Tajirun, Tujarun. <laughs> it is a different pattern. Tajirun is taj, not Tajiruna. Tujarun. Are you with are, what? Is it? Waladun, Auladun. Ibnun, Abnaw. So, but this is the magic in Arabic language. Huh? It may sound little difficult and complex, but as we read along, it becomes very easy. It becomes very easy, you know. So, inshallah, we'll continue this tomorrow. I would like you to go home and do this exercise. How will you do this exercise? Only this exercise. We have not done the lesson, but we are doing the exercise. What is the exercise? Haza Talibun. How will you make it into Jama? Aulai Tullabun. Remember, brother, Muptada and Khabar match. Haza Talibun, both are singular, both are Muzakkar. Now, if you make it Tullabun, then it is Haulai Tullabun. Are you with me? Haulai. Next one, brother, Haulai Tujjarun. Next one, Haulai Hujjajun. Next one, Haulai Rijalun. Next one, how will I kibarun? Next one, how will I cigarun? Next one, how will I kisarun? Tiwalun. What is this, brother? This is another dokla. What is this? Another dokra. This is halwa puri, brother. What are you doing? Haza into how will I? And talib into tullabu. Is it difficult? No. Try to do this tonight and we will repeat it tomorrow. Huh? And then inshallah you will become very strong. Rabbana Atina fi dunya hasanatan wa fil akhirati hasanatan wa kina adab al-nar Rabbana Hab lana min azwajina wa zuriyatina kurrata ayunin Waj'alna lil muttaqina imama Rabbana Takabal minna inna kanta samiul alim wa tub alayna inna kanta tawabu rahim. Subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma.